fellas, it's Raptor Jesus here with another crafting video for you. I'm making some of these egg sacks. I made these originally using a, just a paper mache method and put them on some weird spa spare kind of broken terrain I've had and collected over the years. These are meant to kind of be placed in uh, my hallways or, uh, you know, two of these could be placed in a normal uh, dungeon room. Jump cut for you. Sorry. Make sure your seat belts are fastened. Yeah, you know, all I'm really doing is painting all the the bumps I can find on this terrain uh, yellow. Now that the little one's done, I've got to touch it up a bit. Now it's the, the big room, or the normal size tray. This one's actually a, on a CD case. I found that the, the best actually material to put these kind of room interiors in. Yeah, when you use the paper mache method and you want to recreate this kind of terrain, you just got to plop them on whatever kind of terrain pieces you want to put it on. That's all I did, and it kind of made it look like tendrils and such. A lot of it will get covered up once you put the webbing on, but it's the little details that matter. I think it all brings it all together in a unique fashion. about that fellas and now I'm gonna use some uh, this greenish brown wash I have this will also help seal these too because it has some Mod Podge in it now I use all of my spider miniatures <laughs> in this short little video I 3D printed these using my my Ender 5. Alright fellas, that's the rest of the video. I hope you liked it. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment down below. I'll probably try to answer as any, anything I missed, alright? Uh, if you want to see more of this content, please feel free to subscribe. If you would like to support anything I do here at Altered Games, please uh, give me a coffee. Uh, down below there's a link. Uh, I hope you guys have a good game next time you play. And please keep your shield arm strong, alright? No slacking now.